Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Sturge here, and today we're doing the 5K subscriber q and I posted on my channel just over a week ago saying that I was going to be doing a 5K subscriber Q&A video, and I asked you guys for your questions in that thread, and I got a bunch of them from you guys, so we're gonna answer a bunch of these questions in today's video, and I'll also be doing a bunch of attacks throughout the video on basically all of the accounts that I have shown throughout all of my videos on my channel for the past nine months. But let's head on to the questions here, starting off the first one here from Burly Amigo 12 asking, when did I start playing Clash of Clans? And the answer to that question is October 15th, 2014 is when I actually started playing Clash of Clans. So I've been playing Clash for a very long time now, coming up to about seven years now, and it's been very fun throughout the entire time. And actually heading on to our second question here from Josh is what actually got you into Clash of Clans. And honestly, what got me into Clash is probably what got you guys into Clash as well, which is actually from my friends showing off the game to me and I actually liked the way it looked and stuff so I decided to download it myself and start playing and that was in 2014 and now I'm still playing the game so that's how I got into Clash of Clans. And we got another one here from MLHR007 asking how was your experience playing the old COC game back in 2013? What are the differences between the 2014 game and the 2021 game? Now back in the day, back in 2014, it was very hard to progress through the game. There wasn't any season pass, there wasn't clan games, and there wasn't any uh, CWL as well. So there's a ton of new ways to actually progress through the game now, but that wasn't in the game back then. And you also asked to show some clips of the old footage, which I actually have on my channel, which is actually back in 2015, which is actually when I started posting on this channel, but didn't actually attempt to actually create a YouTube channel until around October of last year. And we got another question here coming from Alex asking, how old am I? I am 21 years old and I actually turned 21 a few days ago, which is pretty cool. And we got Nate here coming in asking how to find a serious clan. And I honestly don't really know how to find an actual good clan, but uh, I would guess you have to go and find some Discord servers because usually the serious clans probably have the Discord servers where you can go and request to join through the uh, server of the Discord. Or there's obviously Reddit and stuff that you could go on to find a decent looking clan. And we got Baby Finest coming in here asking what league is the best looking in my opinion and I think Legend League is actually the best because of uh, it's really the only one besides I think Champion League which has an actual animation. And they also asked the second question here which is will you ever be doing a base challenge for subscribers and I actually seen a bunch of other YouTubers do this and I kind of want to do it myself but I'm not sure how I really want to do it. So we're gonna have to wait just a little bit longer to see if I actually follow through with one of these challenges. We got Trickly here asking, how long do you play this game for? And honestly, I'm not too sure how long I play. It all depends on what kind of video I am making. I usually only play when I actually want to create some sort of video. So I would say probably around three to four hours a day I actually play this game. But it still all depends on what video I'm making that day and if I have to make more videos over the span of that day. So it all really depends on what video I'm making. And we have God of War Games asking, how long did you play before you became this good at the game? And honestly, I've been this good since I started playing the game. And we got Miffy coming here asking what got me into cherry pushing and any good tips? Well pushing, I actually got into that probably back in 2016 and there was a streamer that I actually started to watch who was pushing Tunnel 8 and I really wanted to push myself so I decided to try to beat him to his goal which was Champion League and I actually beat him up to that goal which was pretty cool at the time and now obviously I've made a two legend league with tunnel 7 and tunnel 8 so I've beat myself since my old days of pushing and good tips for pushing I would say continue searching for the bases uh, you'll find a decent one eventually make sure you're looking for the bases that you know you at least get a star on and make sure to use your shield wisely I have a bunch of videos on my channel that you can use if you need any more tips for target pushing and we got Ben Ghost is here asking, what has kept you coming back to the game for years after high school? And honestly, YouTube has been keeping me coming back to the game. I've been enjoying making videos, so I basically come back to the game every day and make videos for you guys. We got two questions here coming in from ROJ. First one is, do you think COC is dying? And I don't think it's dying at all. I think the game is still very healthy and keeping up with a very decent player count. It may not be as big as it was back in 2015-2016, but it's still a very popular game to play. And on to your second question here, which is, which is your favorite troop in the game? 
in your favorite town hall. Honestly, right now, the, my favorite troop is probably the Dragon Riders. I've been using it a bunch on my Tunnel 14, and it's been working very well, so I've been enjoying using that new troop. And my favorite town hall is definitely Tunnel 10 because of those walls. The orange lava walls just look very, very cool in my opinion. And we got Nitin coming in here with some rapid fire questions, which I'm gonna answer right now. Tunnel 10 or Tunnel 9, definitely Tunnel 10, like I just said. Tunnel 13 or Tunnel 14, definitely Tunnel 13 at the moment because of the walls. You can't really max out all the walls, so it doesn't look as good. Archer Queen or Royal Champ, definitely the uh, Royal Champ because of the shield, it's a very cool ability. And my full name, I'm not gonna say my full name, but I'll say my first name, which is Andrew. And we got Isaac coming in here asking, when did you decide that you wanted to make YouTube content for COC? And how long were you playing the game before you decided to make content on it? Well, I've been playing the game since 2014, like I said at the beginning of the video, and I actually decided to make YouTube content back in October of 2020. So I've been almost doing this for an entire year, which is very cool, almost hitting one year of making YouTube YouTube content. So we're going to continue to push on through the videos and get a ton more content out to you guys. We got Chicken King asking what inspired you to make videos every day and honestly it's because I enjoy making videos myself and also enjoy helping you guys out with Chori pushing tips and farming as well. We got Nathan coming in here with a bunch of questions. The first one here, have you ever played the Legend of Zelda games? And if so, which one is your favorite? Mine is Breath of the Wild. Well, that's a very good game. I've seen some other people play it and it is looking like a very good game. I haven't actually played it myself. The only game I really play from the Legend of Zelda series is the Link to the Past one on the Super Nintendo, which is a very good game in my opinion. The second question here is what game would you say you have the most hours in, not including COC? I think it's pretty close between Minecraft and GTA 5. I've played so many hours of both of those games. I have around 1500 hours in GTA 5 at the moment, and Minecraft it doesn't say how many hours you've played, so it's either GTA 5 or Minecraft. Will you ever play any other games on your channel? Uh, I'm not too sure. My channel is focused mainly on Clash of Clans at the moment. I wanted to make some Minecraft content at some point, but I'm not sure if I want to be on this channel or a separate channel. And the last question here is, will you ever open Discord moderation applications? And Nathan, as I'm recording this video, you aren't actually mod, but I have uh, made plans to actually make you mod on the Discord server. And by the way guys, if you do want to join the Discord server, I have a link to it in the description of the video in case you do want to join. Basically a place where all you guys can go in and communicate to each other and just basically talk about Clash of Clans or any other game in particular. So make sure to go check it out in the description below the video. We got Sujay coming in here asking, do you play any other games with other than COC? And right now I've actually been playing a bunch of Mario Kart. I've been trying to get my ranking up on the online mode for that game. And I'm almost at 15k right now. I think I'm around like 13,500 at the moment. So I'm, yeah, I'm trying to get my ranking up in Mario Kart. But really I'm only playing Mario Kart and Clash of Clans at the moment. And we got another question coming in here from Newtonian asking, What's your favorite game other than COC? And right now it's probably Mario Kart. But of all time, it's definitely Minecraft. We got Harpreet coming in here saying, congrats on 5k, do you play PUBG? I actually don't, I used to play this back when it came out, and I'm just not a fan of the Battle Royale type video games, so I just don't really play those. When will you start giveaways? And honestly, I'm not too sure when. I really want to do some giveaways for you guys, but there's no real way of giving like gold passes away, so I think I'm just gonna wait until Supercell allows you to gift other people the gold pass. And the final question coming in here from Harpreet is, is who is your favorite YouTuber for COC? And honestly, I like Klaus Gaming, which is a very good YouTube channel. It's probably one of the first ones that I actually started to watch other than probably Galadon. But yeah, Klaus is my favorite Clash of Clans YouTuber. And the final question coming here from Juan Tio, please sorry if I said your name wrong, but will you ever do a face reveal? Now I've been asked this plenty of times and the answer to this one is actually, I'm not sure when. I actually, when I started this channel, I think I really wanted to start showing my face in videos, probably around 25K subs. So I think that might be the goal for now is 25,000 subscribers. We're at 5K right now, so we only need 20,000 more 
to uh, get to that goal. But that was the final question of the day. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. It was dedicated to basically all of you guys for getting me up to 5,000 subscribers. Thank you all so much. Appreciate you guys watching my videos and enjoying them throughout the nine months I've been doing YouTube. I obviously plan on making tons of more content for you guys in the future. And if you did enjoy today's video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.